Hi Virgo Collective. How are you doing? I am doing fine. It's a beautiful day today. And the energies are finally lifting a little bit. There is some intense stuff going on. Oh, all of these are all mixed up cheese. But, um, <clears throat> feels like it's starting to resolve a little bit. And things are looking up. I feel like it was the darkness before the dawn. And, um, good things are coming in right now. So, if I can get my cards together. Let's see what the fortune cards say. Ooh, this is a good one. Golem. A clo what does it say? A close friend that acts on your behalf. The golem is awesome because the golem will, when you're not there, would do for you what you would do for yourself and yeah they're extremely loyal so it looks like you have some a golem around whether known or unknown Hello? winds of change I'm doing a video your surroundings are undergoing transformation Thank you. um the key Uh, locked doors can now be opened. That reminds me, I just... <laughs> Hold on, this is crazy. Let me grab it. <clears throat> my friend... My friend gave me this key. It's the key. And, um... She gave me one before. I told her I lost it that same day. And... It was weird because I was just, um, my chain fell off my bike and I was putting it back on and it fell out of my pocket and I'm like looking on the ground. It's literally was not there. It was just gone. Anyway, she gave me another one. I was like, that last one literally disappeared. And then, um, yeah. Anyways, we got the key and the key. So the key is significant. Anyways, oh yeah, she gave me another one, and then I lost that one. <laughs> and um, I was just sitting here, and I was looking at my floor, and it's literally laying in the middle of the floor, because I couldn't believe I lost a second key. I'm like, is, <laughs> is this a sign? Like, what's going on here? What's going on here? So yeah, I found the key. So, that's a real good sign. Hourglass. Time is of the essence. Yeah, it feels like go time right now, Virgo Collective. Things are moving. Things are moving. Let's get one more fortune card. The Talisman. You are destined to succeed. I'm feeling it in the air, Collective. Things are happening. The, the veil is thinned. People are waking up. I don't know if you've noticed. But there's some, there's some, uh, there's some people that like to sleep in. I've noticed waking up lately. Yeah. All right. Let's get some tarot. Seven of Cups, the illusion, it's thinning. It's possibly thinning for this golem that you have. Three of Cups, there's a reunion coming in. Celebrations, reunion, could be with soul family, could be with a twin flame. Could be with a soulmate. Um, yeah. 
but it's a celebration. It's happy times. You're going to be smiling. Queen of Cups. Yep, you're making things happen right now. You're moving. This is the change. Yep. Things are starting to happen. The magic's starting to set in. The intentions that have been set are coming to fruition. Doors are being unlocked. You're becoming a star. You are a star. But doors are possibly being unlocked to your, in your career. Yeah. Look at this. You have the key to your stardom. <laughs> I'll show you the other key too. You have the key to your stardom. Alright. Death and rebirth. Time is of the essence. Yeah, time is of the essence right now for people who have not shed their masks. <clears throat> this death and rebirth process is highly important for the world, for everybody. And time is of the essence. Three of Wands. This is um, Three of Wands. This is talking about your new business succeeding you will succeed this could this also gives me a twin flame vibe this card and it is reunion card number three is reunion so it looks like definitely you're succeeding in business and if you're on the twin flame journey this is coming in soon if it hasn't already, it's coming in soon. Three, three. You're tapping into the with the ascended masters. Doing your thing. Looking good. Knight of Pentacles. Yep. This is this golem. This golem's taking practical action for you. Behind the scenes, you may not know about this. Ten of Cups. Winds of change. Winds of change are bringing in happy, stable family. Look at that. That's beautiful. That's your change. Your change is being able to manifest your happy family with your soul family. It's all coming together. People are waking up. The key. The key to the star. The star has the key. King of Swords. Is the key is King of Swords? Clarify King of Swords. High, high point of view, high viewpoint, intuitive, intelligent, hangman, looking within, having looked within and found the light from within, that's the key, this higher perspective, this wisdom, this transformation this death and rebirth. Clarify time is of the essence. <laughs> the lovers.
death and rebirth. Your love life, love life is going through a death and rebirth process, rebirthing process. Possibly a Gemini is involved. Air sign. High Priestess. This business is fueled by your intuition. This reunion is being fueled by your intuition. You already know this is all happening. The main thing is not letting yourself doubt your intuition. You have increased your intuitive powers as of lately. And, and um, you can trust them more. Practice, you know, work at it. You can trust them so much more now. This is, it's like you're just tapped right in. Page of Cups. Starting off small. Clarify Page of Cups. Yeah. Walking away and starting new somewhere else. As a novice, who cares, right? You can start all over again. Plant seeds wherever you want to. Okay, let's, um, let me switch decks. Kids are playing video games again. Out of control. Um, alright, let's clarify, um, Page of Cups, Eight of Cups. Yeah, you're walking away from Nine of Swords. You're walking away from anything that causes you fear or anxiety, like people you can't trust, places you can't trust, things you can't trust, you know. You're walking away. And you got the sun, you're walking towards the sun. Yeah. And you're really, you see how she's looking out over water, you're, you're analyzing your emotions. Okay. I was about to say clarify lovers, but judgment. Judgment has been called on some kind of love situation. It's like right under, um, time is of the essence. This is the time. The time is now. The time to act is now on love, in love, in all directions. Clarify lovers and judgment. Nine of Cups. Wishes fulfilled. The wishes fulfilled. That's beautiful. Let me, you know, I want to get an animal spirit card. Monkey. All right. Symbology, agility, courage, um, spirit. The monkey is an ancient deity worshipped by Middle Eastern peoples. In the Hindu Ramayana, a monkey hero named Hanuman helps rescue Sita, the god Vishnu's queen, who had been abducted by a demon. Hanuman was made invisible by Brahma, the grandfather and creator, and possesses the skill and agility to leap across the heavens. He leads a monkey army against 
the demon and res rescues Sita, for which he is granted everlasting life. Yep. <clears throat> you are, you rescue people from demons. Yep. All right. Do, do you do? Or possibly you're being rescued from demons. Get him on out of here. We're done with that phase. It's over. It's time for them to go. Daniel, I am the angel of marriage and I am assisting you right now. Yeah, some of you are getting married, y'all. This love is coming right all over this reading. And there you go, the angel of marriage. So... The key is within. It's your amulet, your talisman, your knowledge, your inner knowledge. You've got it all. You know exactly what's going on. You're highly intuitive. And just follow your instincts. You can't go wrong at this point. You just can't go wrong. The veil is so thin. All right, collective, I will check back with you later. I love you. Take care.